I present Knight Templar, Sir Delrin Baris, second son of Ban Jevrin Baris of Ferelden. Sir Baris, may I be so honored as to present Lord Esmeral Abanage? I'm the one who sent word to Callan. He said the Inquisition works to close this breach in the veil. I didn't think you'd bring such lofty company. Paris, moderate holdings, your family. And the second son? <laughs> this promise of status has garnered interest from the Lord Seeker. Beyond sense. The sky burns with magic, but he ignores all calls to action until your friends arrive. Should a Seeker lead the Templars this way? In an emergency, if there's no other recourse. But his goal should be to restore them to order. He has taken command. Permanently. If he fears there is a holy mandate. That is what the Lord Seeker claims, and our commanders parrot him. <laughs> the Lord Seeker's actions make no sense. He promised to restore the Order's honor, then marched us here to wait. Templars should know their duty, even when held from it. A Templar who remembers his responsibilities? I am reassured. Winova, the Lord Seeker, and every able-bodied knight will help the Inquisition seal the breach. It's why the Inquisition came, Sir Barris. I'll tell you your chances, but the officers are a mystery lately. We've been asked to accept much after that shameful display in Balroyo. Our truth changes on the hour. Don't keep your betters waiting, Barris. There's important work for those born to it. The Lord Seeker has a request before you meet him. These are the standards. An honored right centered on the people, the Maker, and the Order. The Lord Seeker asks that you perform the right, so he may see the order in which you honor them. What if I fail? Well, there's no correct answer. The ritual simply shows watchers who you are and what you value. Fancy title aside, I don't actually command the Inquisition. That doesn't seem to matter. The Lord Seeker changed everything to meet you. Not the Inquisition, you. By name. Why? I don't know. He's been fixated on you ever since your horde of nobles arrived. The Lord Seeker makes us shuffle flags around. Refuse! Let's meet the man already. We'll complete the ritual as the Lord Seeker requests. When you've completed the rite, I'll take you to him. Traditionally, a participant in the rite now explains their choices to those assembled. Those are my choices. The rest is my own affair. It's rather not. I'll not be shut out of any explanation these clods understand, if we're bringing them to heal. I suppose those are your intentions. My intent is to deal with people who matter. You helm louts are wasting the Inquisition's time and my time. Unacceptable. The Lord Seeker awaits you both. Follow me. It's necessary, you know. You don't run a battlefield by committee. Without faith, you've no knights. You've... Knight Captain. You were expecting the Lord Seeker. He sent me to die for you. Knight Captain. Lord Esmerel Abernash. Honor. It is not unlike the second dispersal of the reclaimed Dales. No doubt rank puts you above such things. A pity more people don't understand that. <laughs> this is the Grand Alliance the Inquisition offers. Sir Barris, I'm right in assuming the Night Captain has seen better days? You. Be ready. Yes, be ready to be left behind, Knight Captain Denham. The Lord Seeker had a plan, but the Herald ruined it by arriving with purpose. 
It sowed too much dissent. Night Captain, I must know what's going on. You are all supposed to be changed. Now we must purge the questioning knights. For once, I agree with them. The Elder One is coming. No one will leave Ferenfal who is not stained red. Make us breath. <laughs> <laughs>